So how did you make the, the mountains? We started with uh, bags of concrete that we uh, poked holes in and split open. In some cases we poured the concrete into smaller bags uh, at the lower ends of the hills and watered all that down to solidify it. And after that hardened, we used a uh, landscaping uh, mesh. It's a plastic mesh. It's got like half inch square holes in it. And we shaped the sides of the hills with that, tacked it in place. And on top of that, we spread the uh, mortar. And while the mortar was still wet, we pressed uh, wrinkled aluminum foil against the mortar and let that sit and dry. And then uh, peeled the aluminum foil off the uh, mortar uh, 24 hours later at least. Uh, we did, uh, prior to uh, putting the aluminum foil on the wall, we uh, coated the aluminum foil with uh, uh, vegetable oil, ham, something like that, non-stick, so that it doesn't, didn't adhere to the, the uh, mortar. Is you're not really mixing cement, you're just carrying the bags once, putting them in place. And then, then you mix up a batch and, and, and just spread it on uh, onto the uh, landscape mesh. And then uh, when it dries, it's it's all uh, has the rocky effect already. And, what kind and of all paint? you do is paint. It's what a, kind of paint did you use? It's a Krylon spray paint we get at the oh. hardware store. There are three, okay. three different shades on here. There's a, there's a brown, there's a gray, and there's something that almost looks yellowish. It's a very light tan. And the combination of the three give it a re very realistic effect. <laughs> Paint fades and, and uh, uh, over the last couple of winters we had some pieces of the rock just break off from the freezing and thawing and uh, we just paint right over it again. <laughs> so every, every year it gets, uh, parts of it get a fresh paint job. But, uh, How long has this been out here? Uh, these walls have been out here through two winters now. Uh, they were installed in the summer of 2003, and, and they've been through. So two, the only two thing winters. supporting the track there, and then is the cement bag mixture underneath. Yeah, underneath. And, and and we shaped the top of, of the the hills so we could we could put the ballast in under the track. So it's it's like in a cup at, at the top.